What's up, home chicken? Zach Scott here, and you're watching Zach Scott Games. Last time we left off, I've been trying to convince this guy. Well, I've been trying to get past this guy to get these barrels. I need some 190 proof grain alcohol, and I'm almost positive it's in those barrels. Let's look at this bowl of crummy soup one more time. Mm, needs more of something else, right? I think so. I think it needs some ingredients. Okay. I've got some more ideas about your soup. Do tell. Let's <laughs> see. Have you tried... Have you tried paprika? Paprika? Uh, I, I just think it could use a little uh, color. Color? Hmm. hmm. So what am I supposed to do while he's uh, doing this? I don't know. Well, he's messing around with the soup. I'm supposed to be figuring shizzle out. This isn't gonna work, is it? Ah, uh, maybe I need to get rid of the noise. Kitchens for management only, Rummy. Yeah, no. Rummy. Maybe there's some sort of item I have. Do I have? What do I have in my inventory? I always forget. Arthur's hat. Hmm. No, that's not gonna work. All right, let me, let me, uh... What do you have to say? Huddle up, Emmett. Huddle? Just listen up for a second. Emmett, I can't get into the door over there. Those tables are jamming it shut. The door? So your plan is to just waltz in there <laughs> and take a barrel of alcohol? Uh, no, of course not. That would be stupid, right? I get I'll shot. Say. Still, I'd like to get that door open. I can't do anything from out here. Well, it's a simple matter of physics. A lever, some sort of stop. Let me see what I can come up with. It's a simple matter of physics. All right, you got it? You got it? You got it? I, I want to mess up this guy's timeline. Ah, oh, man, he's done. Man. I know I'm just supposed to have him. Maybe I'll use the telephone. Who am I calling? I have no idea. Brown resident. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Still, <laughs> what is this guy thinking? <laughs> I wonder. Like I'm trying no to. No way! I'm gonna keep that door open without some help. Why do I want to go that way? Maybe I want to go through the back. Hey, uh, it's a matter of physics. Gosh, I wish I weren't so like horrible at these games. Hmm. Nope, nothing yet. Do you guys see anything I can use? Eureka! Ah, oh, now he has an idea. What is happening? He's just gonna leave? Oh, there's a secret code, I bet. What? Okay, remember that. There were three knocks. Oh my god, there's something down there. What? These speakeasies are crazy. Oh, some more. There's some more, don't worry. Oh, man. I just wanna go out through back. Well. Oh. All right, what's your eureka moment, Doc? Emmett. Yeah. Yes? <laughs> All right. Let's see, nice door jam. Oh, that's interesting. Just a little mechanical ingenuity. In the end, the door is open. Yeah, good job. Um. Any ideas <laughs> about how to get the hooch? The hooch? hooch? <laughs> Alcohol, Emmett. It's called the uh, hooch where I come might from. Come to the conclusion that the hooch is being hidden in some of those barrels. Yeah, I knew that. You're probably right, but which one? Probably ones? the ones the guy oh, brings if I could in. I get my hands on some of those barrels. I could weigh them and compare their specific gravity. Specific gravity? Come, come on, on Emmett. Emmett. Kids goons aren't going to let us do an experiment on their barrels. I think it's oh, probably the ones right. that go you know, down. Have to ask the guy behind the counter. Oh well, yeah. Ask him if any of his barrels are filled with illegal moonshine. Get real here. Well. I imagined a modicum of subtlety would be used. Subtlety, right. 
I just want to see what he has to say. I know. Obviously, this kitchen isn't the speakeasy. It's downstairs. Indeed. This must be some sort of front meant to cleverly and legally obfuscate the existence of a hidden establishment of ill repute. Perhaps in the basement. Right. That so might true. Explain the elevator. Oh gosh. I can figure out this stuff myself. <laughs> score that hooch somehow. I'll keep cogitating. All right. Now what? Oh, okay. What what is happening? I'm spinning around. Pretty neat, Doc. <laughs> nope. I'm, I'm still not getting through here. Come on, Doc. At least those tables are propped up now. What? I hope Doc Junior's thingamabob holds out. All right. All right. Emmett, anything else? Emmett. Anything yes. else you want to report to me? No? Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, exit. There we go. No! Oh, I always hit escape. We'll score that hooch somehow. I'll keep cogitating. Keep on thinking about it, buddy. I want to mess up this guy's timeline so bad. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Let me talk to this guy. <clears throat> this game's a lot what of talking. Is it, kid? I want some hooch. Um, I still think the soup needs more flavor. <laughs> Man, I would be getting angry with this guy. No, I'm not the not more salt. Come on, cue ball. Now what? Crap. Bolo crummy soup. Yuck. Still pretty gross. If you ask me. How can I just jump over there? Let's do it. Oh, more noise. The kitchen's for management only, Rummy. <sighs> I'm the biggest idiot in the world. There's gotta be something cool. Okay, I'm just gonna start using stuff in my inventory. Like this hat. I'm gonna use it on the bowl of soup. I don't think that would be interested in Arthur's hat. What about you, Rummy? Oh, uh, wait, wait. Ah, oh, wait. I think he's using chili powder, if you ask me. Let me try uh, busting out this uh, this hat for uh, this guy. Hey, buddy, you want a hat? This hat belongs to my grandfather. <laughs> Noted. Jeez. All right. What else does he have in here? In his little bag of tricks. Maybe he's interested in like a high-tech tape recorder. That would be hilarious. I don't want to record them right now. All right, all right. Jeez, don't make me use the hints. I'm gonna get out of here. It's gotta be something else to do, right? Whoa! It's ooh la la, Miss Strickland. Miss Strickland. Come for some more soup? Come now, Mr. Donnelly. You know I wouldn't set one foot in this mockery of all that is good and decent if the poor of Hill Valley weren't so dependent on Mr. Tennant's overblown show of generosity. Was that a yes? Just give me the soup before I gag on the hypocrisy. That one's the soup. Maybe. I'll tell the boss you said hello. Or maybe I'll it's not. I'll just bet you will. Um, or maybe that's the alcohol. Do you have anything else new to say, Q Ball? About uh -oh. this hot lady who struts in. Kid? Uh, no, I'm out of here. Mind if I look around a bit? No. <laughs> All right, let me try the soup. Maybe, just maybe, it could use another ingredient. I have some more ideas. I still think the soup needs more flavor. I would be like. F you, kid. Okay, not more salt. Come on. Okay, let me just get out of here. I'm gonna go track down that Edna or whatever her name is. I forget. All right, let's get out of here. Come on. All right, Doc's right behind me. And loading. <laughs> All right, that was a stupid adventure. <laughs> or maybe not. Where am I going? Oh, where did you go now, Doc? Oh, is there a way in through the back? Soup kitchen. Gosh, where the crap is do I go? I don't know. I don't know. I just... 
I'm just horrible at these. Maybe I'll talk to the real doc. By the real doc, I mean this guy. Psst, doc. Doc. Marty, how goes the escape plan? I need booze. Your younger self needs 190 proof booze to fuel his rocket drill. Well, that could be a problem. I know. We're both underage. Underage, <laughs> nothing. It's 1931, and alcohol's been outlawed throughout the country. Are you sure you're about to graduate from high school? I'm kidding, Doc. It was a joke. A joke? If I live to be a hundred, and I almost have, I'll never understand a teenage compunction to make a joke out of everything. <laughs> That's my life. All right. Um. Anything new? Anything new to say? Let's see what he has. Got any words of wisdom for talking to Edna? Just play along with her. She may seem like a harmless kook, but she's got a journalist's nose for news. News. I will make some news. Hang in there, Doc. Hang in there, Doc. All right. Gosh, I just don't know what to do in this game. Am I like the biggest idiot ever? Or am I just bad at point and click adventure games? Or is it none of the, oh, there's Edna, Edna. Well, guess what? I'm gonna talk to Edna next time but until then you guys be safe and have fun if you like this video uh give it a thumbs up if you like me playing back to the future just uh click the like button now don't don't wait don't click it in the past or the future click it now in the present okay thanks for watching until tomorrow uh be safe and have fun